Hi, my name is Marlene James and I'm answering today who comes to a boudoir shoot. When you hear boudoir photography, you already think about, you know, nudity and, um, and your pictures out there with uh, your lingerie and you think also Victoria's Secret and also like nobody looks like Victoria's Secret models do. So yeah, it's a, it's a bit of an adjustment of, I mean, I, it's hard, it's not an adjustment, it's changing minds about what boudoir photography is and not just that pretty uh, Victoria's Secret uh, picture is. So by answering who comes, I think it it's, gives more of an explanation. I'll, it ranges by seasons, that's for sure. My busiest se season to shoot is actually, right now, um, April, May, in June, because that's a uh, wedding season in Canada. So those are my clients that are about to get married and meet at boudoir, meet at boudoir session for as a gift to the group. That, th th that those three months are pretty busy, and um, and my client is obviously between 25 and 35, and it's their first marriage, and that they're yeah they're excited about getting married, and they need something to give the girl. And it's 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 great to see because that's like the young clientele I get that are you know they they had um, they're in, they haven't had kids or maybe most of them. And I tell them like, yeah, like this, this is a time to record the body, like your body, how it is, because it's going to change so much in the next 10 years and the next 20 years. So it's nice to have that, that uh, memory and for you to have it, not just to give it to you, the groom. So that's that clientele in that season is I think my youngest clientele that I get. And, um, yeah, and people are booking their appointments for, the, for those reasons. But then I also get some time in, in random times of the year, and especially around Christmas and Valentine's Day, I get the wives that have been married for 10, 20 years and um, need a present for their husband. And the husband has kind of hinted that they really would like getting a boudoir session. So then that age group starts from 30 to the oldest, girl I had 60-ish. I even had a girl that was late, a client girl, a woman that was um, 70 and did a boudoir shoot. But she did it for herself though, not for a man. Um, she just felt good and, and decided to do it. So that's also like goals <laughs> to be that age and be that confident and comfortable in your skin. It's awesome. So yeah. So and who comes like I don't I don't know how people find me so I am always curious to see how they find me and most of the time it's just my website gave all the information and, and they book me they don't even call me which is good because I I'm so awkward in the phone and I don't have to come in so, <laughs> so my website does that for me and yeah uh, I sometimes it's word of mouth like. Uh, there was one time one of the girls told all their neighbors or a group of friends and they all came at separate times and they're all like, yeah, they got their gifts for their husbands. So it's, that's, that feels nice when people recommend you. So, so yeah, uh, that, that's how I've been doing this for, I don't know how many years, since 2006, 13 years. Oh my gosh. So, so yes. <laughs> That's yeah, all the type of people that come. Ah, and sometimes a couple comes. And I love that when the people that have been together for a while and they're there and they always say, Oh, before we get any older and we've been together for a while and we want these pictures to kinda like preserve the moment and something to look back and hide from the grandkids, I guess. <laughs> Or traumatize their grandkids when they're, <laughs> when they're older. So, yeah, it's it's a fun thing to do, and especially nowadays that uh, people have a phone and they can, you know, you take two thousand selfies. Like my phone is full of stupid selfies that I never post because they're so awkward. And everybody, and there's people that take awesome selfies all the time. So they, I don't think they need a door shot. 
but people that need a, like the extra boost and extra uh, guidance, then they come to me. And yeah, it's it's you have a professional photo, and it's way beyond the selfies. I, I think. <laughs> and people take guys' selfies though. So yes, that's that's the kind of people I come to visit. Then to come get a door shoot, and I love it. I'm going to change it for the world. Thank you.